Well, would you pay seven to nine hundred pounds for a silver box? I would. <laughs> you know I would. <laughs> Tell me about it, because that is drop dead gorgeous. It's lovely. Um, lovely arts and crafts period silver box made in Birmingham by Henry Charles Freeman. A normal little box of that period wouldn't make a great deal, but it's just so stylized. It's got a lovely piece of enamel on the top and these strap hinges and a bit of spot hammering and things. So it's just really pretty and stylish. God, it screams the period. What oh, year was it? It's about 1903, something yeah. like that. It screams yeah. that, yeah, doesn't it? Yeah, it's very arts and crafts. Super stylish of the period. Estimate again? Seven to nine hundred. Seven to nine hundred pounds. Dig around in the drawers at home. You <laughs> might have solid silver boxes at home waiting to be discovered. And if you do have them, bring them to me. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he's desperate for them because he loves selling these more than anything else. <laughs> Seven to nine hundred, what's it going to make? I think it'll make seven, eight hundred. OK, yeah. let us know how close you get to David's auction hammer price. Good luck again. Good luck. Uh, one, two, one. An Arts and Crafts silver enamel box by Henry Charles Freeman. Pretty again, with the enamel on it. I'll start your way here at 500 bid. 500 bid, I'll take 550. 500 bid, 550 I'll take. At 500 bid, 550 next. At 500 bid, 550, 6, 600 bid, 650 against you, 700 bid in the room, 700 bid in the room, it's on the floor, 700 pounds, and we all done to finish, at 700, all done, 